You promised that you're gonna destroy Virgil, and it happened. It was a great fight, great heart of the Mexican, but you have the, the victory. Yes, yes, you know, I told you, Miguel, this is not gonna be a 10, I know it's 10 round fight, but we are not gonna finish. Uh, in, in, in what moment you feel that you're gonna win? Because you started really early trying hits like big punches, you know? Yeah, no, that, the, the whole thing when I, I, I step in the ring, you know, me and my team, we, 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 we already spoke about mm -hmm. we must start we must start early and we must start we must go we shouldn't wait for more rounds it's when we pick up okay we must pick up from the very first round that's what I, that's what I did you, you are worried about the, the, the left hook of Berchel because sometimes he hit you with the left hook yeah not but that not that, not that much you know I, I I can clearly see when he's, okay, he's okay. trying to, yeah. to throw or when he's throwing it that's why sometimes I just smile at him and then hit him again. You are the faster guy in the ring. In I notice you're really fast. Yeah, I I'm fast. I'm fast. I'm strong. You know everything. Now what is gonna happen? You're gonna stay in 135 or you're going for 130 again? Yeah, no, I feel much stronger at 135, but still I can. Uh, if there's a good fight for me at 130, I can still do. I can fight at 130, at 135. You know both both weight. I can I, I can do. I can I can fight. Uh, Bob Arum told me that the, the, the winner of this fight, he could fight any. Devin Haney, Cambosos, Lomachenko, I mean, you name it, in 135. That's a big name and, and big money as well. Yeah, yeah, I feel much stronger at, 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 at 135, you know, and this is just to give a signal that, yeah. you know, to the, well, uh, to the uh, lightweight division that, you know, I'm here. And whenever they talk about lightweight, they cannot forget to mention my name. And I'm coming for all these boys that have built. I'm coming for them, and I'm gonna show them who I am. Two more things before I leave. Uh, what is the message that you wanna send to your country, but to Mexico as well? Because uh, I mean, in Mexico, it's a the boxing is a religion, and we recognize your work. Yes. No, the message to back home. You know, I I, I just appreciate the, the the courage that they give me. You know, yeah. they motivate me. You know that you know I must come back to with a win, yep. and then uh, you know to the Mexican. Also, I, I just want to appreciate the Mexican. Mm -hmm. You know, it was uh, it's my dream come true. You know, beating a Mexican. You know, yeah. Mexican. They are they are real fighters. They are tough contenders. You know, I feel like a bit Canelo because Canelo is also Mexican. Okay, and finally, give me one name in one thirty five that you're gonna fight against. One name. Yeah, <coughs> yeah. Any, 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 any in the lightweight. Hey, David Henny, I can fight David Henny. Okay, here. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I want David Henny. You know, I, I like all the guys that have belt in the lightweight division, and I'm ready. I, I can fight. No one can do th anything to me. Okay. Thank you, Nakatila. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Good to see you. Thank you.